really, like I just can't do this. I'm standing here overlooking the Ottawa River in the cities of Ottawa and Gatineau. And recently new to the city, I was attracted to the area for many reasons. Whether it was for the beautiful surroundings, the center of government, the cosmopolitan atmosphere, I came here mainly because of the people. My community is the queer community. And being new, many of my friends from far and away would ask, what do you think of Ottawa? And I'd say, I don't know my community yet. This is a reason for the voyage tonight, to explore and ask what makes up our gay, lesbian, bisexual, trans-identified, intersex, queer, two-spirited, and questioning community. How do people perceive our community? What values are there to being active and involved? And what does the future hold for celebrating pride? But first, let's reflect on how community leaders personally perceive their own journey in the community. I found it difficult to connect with the lesbians and I found that it was not always that easy to uh, make new friends or, or meet new women. I haven't really uh, found, uh, until fairly recently, I haven't found as many uh, women that I, I found were really you know, interesting and, and dynamic for me to get to know. Since I've only lived in Ottawa for less than four years, uh, my first impression I can give you was, boy, this is a really small town and everybody knows everyone's business. People are supportive of each other, uh, in particular people who give back to the community. And there's a, a key number of people in the GLBT community here that do, do participate in different events supporting each other. I don't have a lot of, I'm recent, I've just recently come out. I live in, right in Centertown and I find that very open. Uh, I walk down the street holding my girlfriend's hand and I don't, I get a few looks but nothing that uh, would cause any concern. Um, so overall I'd say that it's a, it's a great place to be gay if, if that's the way you identify yourself. There's a lot of gay men and lesbians and bisexuals here. But, it, but it's, it sort of feels like a small town because really everyone knows everyone else. I run into some of the same people here or at the, say playing volleyball or maybe shooting pool or uh, gay bowling nights or at the movies. Community in Ottawa is so very diverse. I remember uh, I've lived here mo all of my life and the changes that have been made in the 40 some years that I've been here where at one time you had to hide and I lurk in the shadows to now you know, very out and very open. The gay lesbian community is not all about going to bars and, and doing that type of thing. It's, it's about getting out and doing activities together and, and uh, enjoying themselves. So this is all front crawl. We're focusing on um, uh, short distances. Well, Speedos is a, it's a master's swim club and it's a safe place for the GLBT community in Ottawa to come together and learn a new sport, meet some new people, and in a non-competitive environment. Uh, we have a lot of social events. Oftentimes, a lot of the whole group will go out on Sundays after practice for brunch. Um, we have a lot of swim clinics so that people of all ages and abilities of swimming can come and learn stroke improvement, but also in a really fun environment where you're with people of the same uh, culture and in the same community and um, of all different places of work and of different age groups. So if you're looking to meet new people, it's a great place to come, but also it's a, the focus is on the sport. the opportunity for singers who are gay, lesbian, bisexual, transgendered, uh, or just want to come out and, and sing with a bunch of people who are GLBT, 
a chance to get together in an environment where they feel safe and comfortable. They can come and enjoy each other's company. They can be happy and comfortable being gay in that environment, but still enjoy choral singing at a very high level. Some of the values have to do with the singing because some of our repertoire has to do with gay pride and about the value of each human being. Uh, a lot of the value though of being in the choir, some of it is the value you could find in any choir, that is being part of a community of people who share a common interest. But I think the people in this choir especially value it because it is a place where they can come and be comfortable as a gay person.